Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Hola, bienvenidos a mi canal. On today's video, I will be showing you guys how to create this look. It's perfect for summer. So if you guys want to know how to create this look, just make sure you keep on watching. But before you do that, make sure to hit that subscribe button. That way you guys don't miss any of my videos. Also, don't forget to turn on your post notification bell. And if you would like, you can go ahead and follow me on my social medias. They'll be down listed below. Let's get started. Okay, so I already went ahead and primed my eyelids with concealer. And I'm not going to set it today. That way our eyeshadow is more pigmented. And I already did my face makeup off camera because I went somewhere before this. And I had done my eyeshadow, but I took off my other eyeshadow. And I'm going to be filming this tutorial. So that's why I have like eyeshadow on my lower lash line. But just ignore that for now. And if you want to know what products I use for my face, I will link them down below in the description box. Today we're going to be using the Take Me Back to Brazil palette by BH Cosmetics. I'm going to start off by using the yellow shade all over my crease. And then I'm just going to be using this brush right here. Since I didn't set my concealer, I'm just going to tap on the eyeshadow first and then blend it out afterwards. So once you have the color set, now we're going to start blending it out upward. So once you're all done blending out the yellow shade, now we're going to go in with this orange shade right here. So you're going to add it to the crease, but you're going to try to bring it lower than where you left off with the yellow. That way we get a greedy effect look. And I'm going to be using this little blending brush like this. And again, we're going to tap the product on first and we're going to be blending it afterwards. So we're going to be adding it to the crease and also to the um, outer V. So I already added the orange and I'm just going to blend it out. And remember to, to blend it out lower than the yellow shade. So now I'm going to go back in with the brush that we used for the yellow shade. I'm not going to add any more eyeshadow to it but I'm just gonna use that brush to blend these two colors together so I'm just gonna blend them together from the top okay so next up I'm gonna be using this darker orange shade and I'm just gonna place that all over the lid and I'm gonna be using this flat brush I'm just gonna pack the color on. Once you're done adding that orange shade, you're gonna go back in with this little blending brush and not, do not add any more product, but just try to blend any harsh lines because of that orange shade that we added. So just to give the look a little bit of depth, we're going to be using this brown here. This is the Morphe 35C palette. You could get any brown, doesn't matter. The Take Me Back to Brazil one didn't really have like, it had like this brownish color, but it's a shimmer and it's too light. So that's why I'm just going to be using a different palette. So just try to look for a, um, a brown color and I'm just going to be adding that to the outer corner. brush wasn't working for me so I'm just gonna I just change it to this more fluffier brush so that's it for the eyeshadow and I'm just gonna grab some of the airspun loose face powder 
in the color translucent. That way we can shorten up the look a bit. You could clean it up with foundation when you're doing your foundation or concealer, but since I already have all my face done, I can't do that anymore, so I'm just gonna clean it up with powder. So just like that and just to clean it up and make it look a little bit sharper and I'm just gonna dust it off with my powder brush. Since I already have a little bit of brown on my lower lash line, I'm just gonna go ahead and add some yellow. And then I'm also gonna add a little bit of inner highlight. This is from the Modern Renaissance palette. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put some eyelashes off camera and these are the ones that I'm gonna be using today. All right, this is a finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos and turn on your notification bell. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.